This video is going to show you how to build and include mobile surveys and forms within your messages. Enabling your customers to share their feedback using a mobile form is far quicker and more convenient. Your business benefits from better completion rates while your customers haven't had to complete a lengthy paper survey. Let's get started. Log into your Messenger account and navigate to Surveys. Click Create New Survey. Give the survey a title, a descriptor. Decide whether you want this open-ended or whether it needs a start and an end point, And decide whether you're happy to allow multiple submits or not. Once happy, click Save Survey Settings. We're now ready to create the survey itself. Your first consideration is, do we want a title and a descriptor as the first page that that customer see, uh, receives when they open that link? If that's the case, remember to edit the already prepared template in the bottom left hand corner. You'll do that by clicking Edit and over typing with the relevant detail. If you don't want a title page, remember to delete the template. Self-explanatory, remove the title, remove the welcome message. If we are going to be removing the title and the descriptor template, also remember to make sure that the button for completion is relevant. Clearly, on a title page, you would then expect to be led into a second page, so we would have a start survey button. If you're directing somebody straight into the survey and the questions will be set straight off the bat, clearly you won't want a start survey button, you'll want something like a submit or a finish. So what we're going to do is we're going to edit that from start survey to submit, save the item, and as you go with this, just for sanity purposes, if ever you want to preview back what the survey looks like at that point, there is a preview page button here and as we can see now we've got our blank canvas with the title and the descriptor template removed and simply just our submit button there. What we now need to do is we need to add items onto that page. So refer to the add item to page button. We have the option to include titles. From an aesthetics point of view we can upload images. So for instance, if I want to say, OK, we want our image on there, I click the image box, I give this a title, I choose where I'd like that ordered on the page, add item to the page. I've now told the system that we want to include uh, an, a, a logo, but we haven't physically put that in yet. So we refer to the bottom left-hand corner, um, where we now need to edit. We select our image upload that from our desktop and save the item. Refer back to add item to page and here now we have our data capture options. So we can choose from long and short text entry boxes, single and multiple choice drop down, check boxes, radio buttons, star ratings, date and time pickers, device locations and hidden data fields. For now we're going to choose a short text entry box we're going to title the name of the question. It's not the actual question itself. We're going to order it, so we want that to go after the logo. We add the item to a page. Again, we now need to manage in the left-hand corner. So we're going to edit, and we're going to change the question to name. Save that item. If we preview the page back now, you can see here would be our logo and the form now is starting to build out. You would just repeat that process until you're happy with the form and once you're happy just click finish and what we now need to do is design our finishing page so what the customer is going to see once they've hit the submit button. Again we put some pre-prepared templates in there for you maybe that you want a title or a completion message for me, to keep things nice and straightforward, you would probably remove the title page, or the title template, should I say, and just edit the completion message um, with a, a, you know, a simple thank you, we'll be in touch soon. 
Well, certainly something relevant to the uh, aim of that campaign, really. Um, so we can save that item now, and ultimately we're ready to send that survey within our outbound message. Uh, as far as the preparation uh, is concerned now, that's, that's all done. So um, away you go.